welcome to Hob 2020 Week 3, three. already. Welcome, Will. Thank you, Jack. Thank you very much for coming. <laughs> uh, um, right, we have got a really exciting thing to talk to you about this week. We've spoken about it, we've trailed it, we've mentioned it many, many times over lockdown about what we were getting up to and how we were meeting that social need when social distancing was in place and we can't have Cafe 43 open. And it was something, Will, that we'd been looking to launch for a long, long time, but we never had the time to really get into it, and also the need, which suddenly skyrocketed. So so what did we do? Okay, well, I found one of the old brochures, actually. Uh, we originally called it the Hob Line, but uh, we've decided we're going to call it the Bread Line. And so basically what we realised very early on, um, really at the beginning of House of Bread, but particularly the pandemic as we rush further afield, further ahead is the amount of people who are socially isolated and it's been exemplified in the um, covid um, pandemic and it's people who are just spending too much time on their own mm. um, so the launch of breadline which was uh, only about two months ago uh, is basically a telephone support line we already have 60 people that are phoned on a regular basis and what i mean by regular basis is it might be that we assess the level of need to call the individual once a week, twice a week, three times a week. Or really they depends. might request request that. Or they might request it. And it's a it's a balance basically. Um, so you'll get one of our trained and constantly upskilled um breadline caseworkers who so will not me. <laughs> who will phone you and, and chat basically. Yeah. Um give you uh, the sort of support that you would otherwise get from perhaps family or friends. Or Cafe um, forty three. And that yeah. was that was the real driver behind it because we realised when lockdown really came into effect. We were delivering to people. So we had a little bit of face-to-face -face contact because it's always really important when somebody comes into Cafe 43 and asks for food that we, we give them a brief look up and down, Will, don't we? A, yeah. a, a really brief assessment because you can very quickly tell if somebody's in a real dire straits. And the deliveries, we, we, could, we got that little bit of face-to-face. -face. And then when lockdown started, the big lockdown started to, to ease and more and more people were coming to the cafe to the side door we realized that we weren't seeing people on a regular basis who would have come down to the cafe every day we were open yeah. and that's that's worrying because we talk about in the winter campaigns over the years we've spoken about social isolation and it really is a problem so that's where the bread line came yeah. from Will, wasn't and it so what would be a typical experience for somebody who um, either is referred to by social services yep. or we recognise would do well with that bread line. So we would make an assessment of the individual's needs. Um, we would then match them to somebody who um, would be one of our caseworkers. So we allocate so many phone calls within a week to a particular caseworker. So we make sure that we're not overloading them. Um, and then we would introduce them. And then between them, they work out the level uh, of need, working with Alex, who's our casework manager. Um, and really, we just sort of respond to the phone call that is about sometimes just the local community. The price of fish, as you yeah, like to say. the price of fish. It's about connecting them with the local community. So we inform our caseworkers if and when activities are available. Um, there might be benefit issues that we might refer to the CAB. It might be a reminder of where service provision is. if, they're, if A they're reminder using. of an appointment. Yeah, or it might be just chatting about um, how Stoke are doing in the Premiership. Uh, it depends on what the circumstances are. Dad really knows his football. Uh, yeah, and it's, it's, a, it's basically the opportunity to keep that person um, informed um, and, and out, part, of the, out of their own thoughts. Yeah, yeah, and, and and you would be surprised, or maybe you wouldn't, of just how many people are in a state of social isolation, and they might be your neighbours. Um, I'm not suggesting you don't engage with your neighbour, what I'm saying is it, it will surprise you just how many mm. people need regular contact. So it's, it's advice, it's support, it's encouragement, it's just engagement. Just a chat sometimes. Yeah. Uh, and, and it's, it's basically a telephone version of Cafe 43. Yeah. And if you've watched these videos, if you know what we're about, if you don't, you can go back and just choose any video and we pretty much talk about it every yeah. week. It's that over the phone. It isn't what we'd prefer to be doing. We prefer to be welcoming everybody in and sitting down and eating with everybody, but we just can't at the moment. The breadline has been a real bonus for people and it's just great that we had that impetus and that time yeah. to be able to set it up. So that's the breadline. If you feel that's something you could do, we always need more people to be able to do it. And the best thing yeah. is, Will, you can do it 
from home. You can <laughs> do it from your own bed, in pyjamas, eating pizza. You can do it however you want to do it. And it really is a fantastic way of engaging with the community, especially during a time like this, while there is a global thing happening. We still haven't had to put any money in the swear jar. We've got loads more to talk about. Next week we've got more stuff to talk to you about, stuff coming in the future. Thank you so much for everybody who's continuing to send in messages, all the stuff about um, what type of clothes we were mentioning yeah. last week. Keep a lookout on all our social medias for all that kind of stuff. It really is the place to understand what we're talking about, why we're talking about it and why it's important. Thank you very much, Will. Thank you. As always for being here. Very exciting, Breadline. Lovely. Thank you very much for watching. As ever, we will see you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.